Hello guys and welcome back to another BrickNet video. In today's video we are doing the fourth Anaxis build. So I'm really excited to get into this video. I'm um, sorry I haven't been posting lately. I was super busy the last couple of weeks with Christmas and New Year's and everything. So I really hope you guys do enjoy this video and remember to like and subscribe and let's get right on into it. Since the last update video I've gotten a ton done actually. So I was able to add another, I think, three or four uh, rows of filler. I was also able to, uh, this is going to be how to access the battery for the lights down there. Let's see if we can put the lights on. Yes, we can. So that's going, that's the battery pack for those lights. So that's going to be holding that. Then actually I was going to, I put a roof on top of this thing. So now both entrances are completely finished. I was also able to add this really awesome line or this uh, kind of like indent all the way around which I'm really happy about it turned out really nicely and I was also able to get the wall up to about the same height except here I ran out of these bricks yes yeah uh, let's see. these bricks so ran out of those so I'm placing a brickling quarter just to get those uh, more in actually what I did was while I was waiting for those I actually added in some masonry bricks along the side here all along this side just to add a little bit more of a um, nice feel to it I never added any masonry bricks on this side but um, I think that looks pretty good and then actually we got that done and then I also am adding these really awesome really cool lights in so, in the episode, there's not a really good, like, shot of all the lights, but I found these really cool lights, like these almost square ones. So, I'm going to add them in every uh, 12 bricks or whatever all the way around, just to uh, make it look a little bit nicer. And I think it turned out really good. I'll flip them on for you. turned out pretty nicely and I also added in lights down there so most of the lights are uh, working uh, but yeah I also added in masonry bricks on this side as well just to make that look nicer but um, without further ado I'll get right into a time lapse of working on this Time-lapse you guys just saw I just worked on all of this so getting this all up to about the same height I'm actually waiting on more of these bricks These right there I'm waiting on more of those again those are coming in a brick and quarter and I actually totally forgot to show this in the first clip but I actually added in this almost drawer or uh sorry like door looking thing it's really cool because in the film Mace Windu, when Anakin Skywalker tells him, oh, there's a bomb in the complex, um, he runs down over to this thing, and like, it opens up and uh, takes him down underneath where the bomb is. So I decided I would uh, recreate this in Lego. So what we have here, is this is the actual door. I know on the TV show it showed like yellow around it. I tried adding yellow, but it was just extremely hard. But I think what really uh, came out really nice is that I actually off-centered every single one. So as you can see, there's a slight lip here between the two, and there's a slight lip here, and then on all sides. And then when you come in here, there's a slight lip between the actual bricks inside and the uh, border. So I think that looks really good. So it actually looks like it's in, uh, set inside. Yeah, I think that looks really good. The only problem about this design is that there is an absolute 
ton of pressure on these bricks right here. Um, these bricks really weren't supposed to be uh, put together all the way and they're like getting smashed together. So that might be a problem getting this out, but uh, that's future. That's, an, uh, that's a future problem. Other than that, I think this looks really good. I was also able to get some tiling done, as you guys see here. But I was able to get some uh, tiling done. I still need those uh, two by twos. I know I keep saying I'll order them and then I just forget to. So um, yeah, those will eventually come. The tiling, I'm gonna need a lot of dark gray tiles. So yeah, if you guys know a good uh, brickling store in the United States that has uh, dark gray two by two tiles for cheap, please leave the link down in the uh, comments. It'd be really really helpful. Other than that, uh, let's get into the outro. So that's gonna wrap it up for building an Axis Week 4 in LEGO. I really hope you guys did enjoy this week's video. I had a super, uh, it was super fun building and super fun making it. I'm actually filming on a new camera. I got it for Christmas, again, super nice camera. It's a Sony, super nice. It's like a vlogging camera, so I might be using this for vlogging, I don't know. Super fun, but other than that, I hope you guys did enjoy this week's video, and remember to like and subscribe, and stay safe, and to stay awesome.